hand. This is what it looks like. Okay, so this is still part of 40 Charleston, but it does look a little different. If you haven't watched the kick-throughs video, I would recommend going to watch it, because in this video we're going to go over how to get in and out of hand-to-hand, -hand, and that actually requires using the move kick-throughs. Okay, so let's get started on how to actually do hand-to-hand -hand first. Our leads and follows will be doing the exact same thing. There is no mirroring in this. We're both going to be doing the same thing. It makes it awesome for practice. Okay. Everyone's going to start on their right foot. Now, if you all remember the exercise we did during the kick throughs video with the kicks and pivot, we're going to be doing something very similar here. So everyone on your right foot, we're going to go ahead and we're going to kick forward. We're going to go kick, middle, and as we turn, we're going to pivot, set. Now our left foot's going to do the same thing. We're going to go kick, pivot, kick, step. All hand-to-hand -hand is, is going back and forth between those two. One key detail to remember is whichever foot you're kicking with, you're going to turn over that shoulder. So if we're kicking with our right foot, kick, pivot, kick, we're going to turn right. If we're kicking with our left foot, kick, pivot, kick, we're going to turn back left. Okay. Hand-to-hand -to -hand together, there's a couple ways to do this. Really, all you need to make sure to do is our leads and follows need to be touching hands every time. We're going to use this to push off of each other a little bit. So girls, give me some stiff arms. Um, that helps us gain momentum. You can do it up here. You can do it down here. However you like best. We like it down here. Um, this is the way we've seen a lot of the pros do it. So all it's going to be is the same motion. We're going to start with our right foot. It's going to go kick, pivot, kick, kick, pivot, kick, kick, pivot, kick, step, kick, pivot, kick. Okay. How we're going to get into this is using kick throughs. Once again, if you haven't seen that video, go ahead and watch it real quick. I'm not going to really explain how to do it. We're going to go through almost the entirety of kick throughs the way we already do. So it's going to be rock, step, kick, step, kick, pivot, kick, step. This is where we change. Guys, we need to hesitate for a couple beats to let the girl turn back. The girl's going to do the same kick, pivot, kick that she would always do. She doesn't know that we're changing the move right here. So our left foot is going to kick three times. There's a couple ways to do this. My favorite way is just to go kick, kick, kick forward. You can also go kick, back, kick, whichever one's more comfortable for you. Or if you can find another way to eat up three beats, go for it. So all we're going to do, the girl's going to do the kick, pivot, kick, and we're going to go kick, kick, Full speed, what that looks like is this. It's going to be rock, step, kick, step, kick, pivot, kick, 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 pivot, kick. Perfect. To get back, we have to be left hand to left hand. This doesn't work right hand to right hand, unless you want to switch places. Okay. So, all it's going to be is the exact same thing. Guys, we're going to hesitate for three kicks again. I'm going to go ahead and just kick three times forward. You can do whatever you want. The girl doesn't know what's going on, so she will keep kick, pivot, kicking. So we're going to go kick, kick, and then we're going to take pivot, kick with her back into 40s Charleston. Once again, what that looks like, go left hand to left hand. Has to be left hand to left hand. We're just going to go kick, 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 pivot, kick. <laughs> Perfect. Anything else to say on that? Uh and girls, I mentioned this in the stop sign video if you watched that, but it's really important to keep barbie arms in hand to hand. Um, you'll notice that I'll have one hand here and I'll keep another hand kind of out to my side. That's really important for when you're doing, especially variations of hand to hand. There are things called a missed turn where you're completely back to back and you can't see your partner. And it's really important to keep your arms out the entire time you're doing hand to hand so your partner can catch you.